So here we are, part two of our video series with Nova Scotia Tourism and Bike Nova Scotia here at the Cancel Causeway right behind me or right in front of me. Uh, we're about like 50 feet into Cape Breton here, the start of the trail, kilometer zero. We are stoked to explore this whole coastline as it goes all the way up to Inverness. None of us have ever done this before, so we are pretty pumped to explore it because it is a beautiful resource to have. Flat biking trail all the way to Inverness. Let's check it out. and one of the things that's probably most exceptional about the island is the incredible music that comes from here. We are at the Judic Celtic Music Interpretation Center and they do it right. chasing the weather all day. We've had rain, we've had fog, we've had sun, but just as we thought it wasn't gonna happen, the sunset made an appearance, and my goodness, it was spectacular. Oh, it's going! Day two in West Mabu. West Mabu dance, West Mabu dance. dance. It's, too early, it's too early for dancing. Dance, dancing. Have we introduced our awesome ladies yet? Are we, yeah, let's bring the team. Um, I'm Emma. I'm Kaylee. And where are you guys from? I'm from Dartmouth, but living and working in Sydney. Nice, and who's this? Emma. Emma, Emma one. <laughs> Emma and one. <laughs> We've and got where are you from? Where are you from? Uh, Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island. been a lot better from a stills photography point of view. Lovely sun. Well, no, we didn't really kind of see the sun rise, but just that gorgeous early morning light. Low winds. We found an area with uh, like a church in the distance, nice reflections. And that felt really good. Got the day started right. So what we're doing now is we're going to grab some grub, like I said, and then we're going to kind of get a, a survey of the area to see where our sunset's going to be. I mean, this area here, which is where the beach is, the sun's setting right in this area. It's going to be absolutely stunningly beautiful. Hopefully, we get a really nice sunset. Sunrise, Lake Ainsley, Have a look. check it out. Unbelievable, just a beautiful, beautiful morning. And this trail that runs right along this little section here is probably one of the nicer sections that, uh, that we've seen um, this whole trip. I mean, just absolutely stunning. So what we're trying to do now is recreate a shot that we got last night that was beautiful. The sun was breaking through and it was uh, kind of shaky depth of field type stuff and we're trying to just get a casual cheers because we have 30 seconds per video and we're trying to cram as much into each shot as possible. So, 
<laughs> this is the end. Well, Cape it sounds Breton, really negative. And we did the South Shore all in the last two weeks. I'm kind of leaning a little bit. I'm not, I'm not trying to pick favorites here, but it is kind of hard to disagree with a sunset like this. And we had the same thing last night, but the thing that really kind of tar put it all together was the fine ladies who got to come with us. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Our bikers on this whole shoot have been <laughs> just incredible. Yes. Narupa, Deandra. Deandra as yes, well. Yes, it's been. Anyways, yeah, we've had our lucky. best time. We're and lucky. this, I think, where we've none of us have done this before on this particular trail. Yeah. We all have a job to go and tell at least 100 people that they have to do it this year. Yeah. I mean, our, our job here was to tell people about how awesome this trail was and to discover it ourselves because we didn't really know what to expect. And we were blown away. Yeah, right. Seriously blown away. You guys convinced? Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yes. High five! Yeah. Go, go, go!